Have you ever felt frustrated doing calculations when a subroom's involved? Well, in this training, you'll learn how to use advanced variables to improve your estimating accuracy. Subvariables refer to variables that represent individual rooms that have been subgrouped together. So basically, they're a letter that represents a room. In this example, carpet is being added to the entry, but not the closet. To add items to just the main part of the room, or to just the subgrouped room and estimate items, first select the main room, then add the item to the main room. Select the item from the items list to populate the quick entry pane. Click on the calculator button to see a list of available subrooms. Each room in the subgroup is given a number, with the main room starting at zero. The number next to each subroom will correspond to the number in parentheses that is visible in Sketch. To apply the item to only that room and not the subgrouped closet, simply add the number associated with the room to the end of the variable. For example, to remove and replace the carpet to the floor of the main room only, change the variable from f to f0. And that's how you can use subvariables to add items to a subroom.